Today in Minecraft, I have my very own little Sunny family. And I have my very own Melon family. This is my baby Melon. I built the coolest house ever for my family. It even has bumper cars. Yeah, but mine's way better. It's the same color as the subscribe button. Please press it right now. Let's try and race to 600,000 subscribers. Oh, where are we, bro? How did we get here? I have no idea. Yeah, but Sonny, what is this? <laughs> it looks like Melanie, and you've got a baby. You're telling me I have a family? What the heck is going on? Melon, I'm so glad you came home. Melon Jr. is so excited to see you. Hello, Papa Melon. Welcome home. Melody, I know we're dating, but like, I don't remember having a kid. What's going on? Melon, you were in a coma for so long, and you've finally woken up. I'm so glad. <laughs> Bro, this is so cringe. I'm gonna beat up your little baby, actually. Don't you dare! Yo, chill, fine. I'm out of here. This is too cringe. Wait, hold on a second, Sonny. There's no way. Wait a second. Uh, sunshine and a baby, Sonny. Don't tell me. I have a family, too. What type of dimension did we drop into? Come on, Sonny. I believe in you. You should make me and Sonny Jr. a cozy house to live in. Uh, Sunshine, you're kind of a crazy fan girl i'm not so sure i want to live with you but we already have a son look his name is baby sunny isn't he adorable oh no oh no papa please build us a house if i stay here too long i'll get sunburned my son that doesn't even make sense you can't get sunburned you're literally the source of all light and energy wait no 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 i'm the source of all light and energy but you're kind of like a baby version sunny maybe we should have a build battle i don't want our little boys to get hurt after all you're right Right. They need a roof over their head, clothes on their back, and food in their belly! I'll prove that I'm the greatest father of all time! No, I'm the best dad, and I'm gonna make the best house ever! Just don't really like that I'm gonna be stuck with sunshine. She's crazy. Well, Sonny, you're the one that picked her. <laughs> Whatever, bro. Let the building competition begin. Whoever has the best house wins. And the loser, their entire family's gonna explode from TNT. What the- No, I- what, what are you talking about, bro? We're just building the house to protect our families. Sorry, Melon. I don't make the rules. I don't make the rules. This is insane. I don't want my little baby to explode. So I guess that means I'm going to have to make the greatest house ever. It's going to be super cozy and really cool. Let's see here. I'm going to need some yellow concrete. No, 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 no. Cut sandstone. That's nice. Some stone bricks. Couple torches to keep the mobs out. And some glass windows. Yep. Ah, time to get building. Don't worry, family. I'll protect you. Papa, please protect me and my melon block friend. Please, please, please. Don't worry. I'll be the savior of melon kind. Melon, I'll take care of Melon Jr. Don't lose to Sunny. We have to win this. Don't worry. I'll make the ultimate melon-themed house. We believe in you, Melon. I think that's a pretty cool design. It's gonna look really good when I wrap it on every corner. Nice little window view area. And I'm gonna put the front door right here at the bridge. It's time to begin the build. First, I just need some nether bricks to lay a proper foundation. I'm thinking I'll put some fences here. Ooh. Maybe some court stairs to build up this balcony. Yeah, yeah, this is genius. We'll have a little red-themed balcony. Absolutely beautiful. And we'll use red concrete for the rest of the house. 20 minutes later. Okay, the first floor is looking Looking pretty good. Now I just gotta go decorate the insides. And I did a little bit of a head start here with the bookshelves, because I'm gonna have a really grand library inside of my house. Because my little boy needs to have a vast wealth of knowledge. And he needs a cozy place to study, right here by the fireplace. And then I gotta fix up my nice marble pillars. <laughs> yes, these are quite exquisite. Without this, he won't be able to appreciate real culture. Yes, absolutely magnificent. Animus. And then over here, I'm thinking the entrance is pretty good. It could just use a storage chest or two. And then some extra flowers. Yes, we need to stay decorative. There we go. Keep sunshine happy. And let's go upstairs. This is going to be the first bedroom in the house. And it's going to need a bed. Otherwise, it's not a bedroom.
room. And it's also gonna have furnaces. But these aren't for cooking food. These are for staying warm in winter. And then on top of that, we'll have some chests full of coal. Oh, yeah. Oh, and a crafting table in case you need to do some arts and crafts. All right, guys, check it out. I have completed my house. But not totally, guys. I still haven't completed the back half. Give me a second. I gotta work on extending this. More crafting tables. And in here, yeah, we need a little bit of storage as well. Let's do that. Furnace build. Oh, this looks pretty cool. I'm pretty happy with the progress. Now I've just gotta keep building this thing up and building it up taller and having a second floor. Yep, pretty much just gotta place a lot of these blocks. Voila! My house is complete. Isn't it beautiful, family? Wow, Dad. This house is so awesome, but I feel like we're missing some decorations or something. I've gotta add... What should I add, Baby Melon? I want a big TV with a PlayStation 5 and a really cool gaming setup so I can play Roblox for a living just like you, Dad. Yo, you're a genius, Baby Melon. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Or in this case, the melon doesn't grow far from the rind. Anyways, time to decorate this house! I've already added most of the basic decorations, like cake, furnace, uh, chest, all that stuff. But I need to have a TV. And the perfect place for the TV would be in the basement. Basement. Just gotta go outside if I want to get there and then access it from here. Let's clear some of this hay out. We don't need this. We need a PS5. We need a couch. Don't need any of this storage. Yes, my house is looking beautiful. I even have a greenhouse room. It's so pretty up here. The sun is shining. The flowers are growing. All I need to do now is put a little bit of a roof, but I want it to look natural and feel good. So yeah, I'm gonna use these spruce planks and and I'm also gonna need some stairs. That's gonna be good. Guys, I have the wall-mounted TV. It literally takes up my whole screen. I can't see anything when I hold this thing. This is gonna be tough to place. I'm gonna have to place it in third person. Wabang! Hey, yo, might not make the entire wall one gigantic long TV. Maybe make it a little thick, too. Yes. This will be the ultimate gaming setup. That looks pretty good. And chairs here. Also, ooh, is there a PS5? That is terrifying. That is not a PS5. We can have a Switch, though. Let's go. And why not have one Switch when you could have two? As you guys can see, I had a change of heart, and I went with Acacia Stairs plus the Sandstone, because I think it looks a little bit nicer with the yellow concrete. And now most of my house is finished. The green room, it's perfect, guys. Look at this place. There's so much natural light in here. Plus, if it's raining, you don't have to worry about catching a cold. But my house feels like it's still missing something something. I've got to add a feature that's more fun. Come on, there's got to be something here in creative mode that's awesome. Yo, potato cannon. The gaming setup's complete, baby melon. Melon, why don't we add a garden full of watermelons? That would be so beautiful, don't you think? You're right, Melanie. We definitely should do that. Creating the farms for my beautiful wife, and then we can grow much more baby melons and be a happily gigantic family. Landmines. Oh, that's not what I need. Whoa, this block looks awesome. Yo, that's cool. But that's not really what I need right now. Wait a second. I'm gonna add bumper cars. All right, there we go. Grab some water. Then what we gotta do is make sure this soil is fertile. Wait a second. I think I just did this the wrong way. I need three blocks in between. No, actually I need four. I am an idiot. One, two, three, four. And now they've been set up. I messed up again. What is wrong with me? And perfect. Now, grab some melon seeds, plant the melons. Absolutely beautiful. And all I've got to do now is the melon chant. Oh, sweet watermelons, watermelons of glory, bring us life to the baby seed melons. Yo, it's actually working. They're growing. They're growing. The watermelons, they're growing at an unprecedented rate. It's beautiful. I'm bringing life to all melons. Now check this out. Very unassuming, my house. Nothing cool underneath it, right? Side Right in here, we've got bumper cars. Let me cover this back up. And now I've just got to finish working on the secret entrance. Yo, back behind the fireplace. This is gonna be perfect. Check this out. 
Ghost block. I've never actually tried this. Can you light a ghost block on fire? Aw, I can't light it on fire. But that doesn't matter because this is perfectly blended in. Look at that. Secret spot. And then we'll put another ghost block right here. And time to add our bumper cars. Yes. Orange versus yellow. And both of those are actually the color of the sun. Yep, I know. Pretty awesome. There's still a few things my house is missing. I need to find a good spot to set up a gaming PC. How else am I supposed to play Minecraft and Roblox all day? Ah, uh, there's gotta be a spot somewhere. Probably upstairs is a better fit. What a beautiful day this is. And the melons are complete. Are you happy with that, Melanie? Isn't it gorgeous? That's awesome, Melon. You're the best gardener ever. I've never seen so many melons in one place. Our house is really cool, Dad, but can we please have a trampoline? Please, please, please. Don't you worry, baby Melon. I will make the most awesome, fun trampoline park you've ever seen. Just gotta extend the island a little bit. There we go. A perfect extension. And now all I've gotta do is begin construction on the trampoline park. Take this out. Grab some trampoline and complete. But what would be really cool is if I built some diving boards so we could get extra height. Diving board? No way they actually have it. Bada bing, bada boom. This is awesome. Yeah, up here should be perfect because there's nothing more beautiful and relaxing than enjoying the nice all-natural terrain of the greenhouse combined with a gaming computer. Let's go. And headset. Yes, it's perfect. Now when they tell me to go touch grass, I'm already here. Here. All I need is a nice, cushy gaming chair. Perfect. Oh, yeah. I should make something with slime blocks over here. Yeah. Some kind of obby so I can go from here. Jump, slime block, onto the trampoline. Yeah, that'll be cool. And complete. Check it out. My trampoline park is awesome. I can go from here. Bounce on the slime, on the trampoline. Oh, I almost... Whoa, whoa. I did make it to the diving board. Baby melon, I made the trampoline park. Thank you so much, Dad. But can you please help me? I'm suffocating in this melon. Um, um, I'll dig you out of there. I won't hurt any melons in this process. You're safe, little buddy. Thank you so much. Our house is so cool. It has to be cooler than Sunny's. Time's up, melon. Perfect, Sunny, because my house is complete and it's so awesome. Bro, it's so puny and tiny and ew. Why do you have a watermelon farm that's full of compost and poo? Oh, bro, because that's what my family likes. We protect the wanderers. No, you literally just admitted you eat poop as fertilizer as your dinner. Yeah, well, Sonny, speaking of poop, look at your poopy house right here. It might be big, but it has absolutely no character, and it's disgusting. What are you talking about, bro? You haven't even seen the inside yet. Plus, I've got epic surprises in there. Well, then let's see it. I'm checking out your house! My family! See my house! Ouch. My family, sunshine, and my beautiful baby boy. Please, come and explore your new home. Melon, I don't think they're that interested anymore. Be free, sunshine! Uh, I guess these bridges were really confusing our family. There you go. Now, now walk around and see your new home. Son, stay away from the edge. That's dangerous. Sonny, let me just check out your house. Whoa. Sonny, you actually did the most mid job I've ever seen, bro. This isn't even that cool. What are you talking about, bro? There's a bookshelf section, which means my baby boy's gonna grow up to be way smarter than you. He might be smarter, Sonny, but he's gonna be a whole lot less fun, bro. You're gonna have a boring child. That is not true at all. Follow me over here. I meant over here. Sorry. My house is too big. I get lost sometimes. I'm following you, Sonny. Come upstairs to the greenhouse gaming room. No way. You're gay. Gaming outside, but inside. That is actually really cool and creative. I know, it's luscious, and if anyone ever tells me to touch grass, I'm two steps ahead of them. You're already touching grass. That's what I'm saying, bruh. Plus, that's not even the biggest surprise in my house. I don't think you're ready for this. All right, Sonny, let's see your biggest surprise. Just follow me back downstairs. You were saying that my baby Sonny's not gonna have a very fun childhood. Well, why don't you walk through the fire? Bro, I'm just gonna get burnt. Let yourself cook! Ow! Ow! What the heck? No! Son! Son! Get out of the fire! No! He's burning himself! That's it. I'm going down. I think your son's gonna die. Hey, that's his problem. For now, though, bumper cars! Yo, this is awesome! Isn't it cool? Cool, bro. But, uh, you know how you said your son's gonna be fun? I think your son is dead, bro. I don't think he's coming back. Nah, I'm sure he's fine, bro. He's literally 
literally made of fire. There's no way that could have killed him. I guess you're right. Yeah, so that's my whole house. What do you think? You know, Sonny, I will give it a solid 8 out of 10. Just wait until you see my melon house, though. Come with me. So you're telling me I can raise a family here? You could, but your family is now dead. Oh. Okay, let's check out your house. Let's go! All right, Sonny, it's time to bust through this diamond wall and check it out. The melon... Yo, get out of my way! <laughs> Yo, Melanie's exploring everywhere already. It'd be a real shame if she were to, uh, uh, slip and fall. A tragic, tragic. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Get out of here, bro. Why are you trying to kill my wife? Bro, it's not that serious. Okay, maybe it is. You literally tried to murder my wife. That is the serious, deepest thing you could do. Well, how are you going to get her out of this predicament, huh? Uh, easy. Ow! And I'm back. Okay, let's see what else this Wander Melon's cooked up out here. Ah, uh, beets? Bro, that is gross. Ooh, but you have a cellar under here. Yo, where are the watermelon smoothies? Bro, we don't eat watermelons here. Oh, what about beet juice? You're growing a whole bunch of vegetables. You can eat these beets if you want, but uh, we haven't learned how to juice them yet. Bro, these things are gross. Dude, whatever. You just don't appreciate it because you're so unhealthy. But Sonny, check this out. You're not gonna believe it. I have the most ultimate gaming setup you've ever seen. Better than mine? There's no no chance. 100% is better than yours. Peep this. Bro, this is the biggest screen I've ever seen. Exactly, Sonny. Now when you're gaming, you can game. Yeah, but Melon, you have a huge problem. Yeah, what's that? You put your giant gaming setup inside of a moldy cellar. Look at these walls. It's disgusting. Bro, that's all part of the design. It just sets a good atmosphere to game in. Yeah, like the kind where I feel sick and nauseated already. Uh, get me out of here. <coughs> fine, fine, Sonny. I'll show you the real crown jewel of this house. The trampoline park. No way, bro. You built an entire trampoline park? It's pretty awesome, isn't it? Yeah, I actually really appreciate this. This is one of my favorite activities. Check this backflip out. Boom. And on this trampoline, you can jump super high. No way. Let me try this. Let me try this. Boing. Yes, I'm going to jump on your roof. All right, I don't know if you can jump that high, but go for it. I'm gonna jump on your roof and murder your family. What is wrong with you? <laughs> Melanie, I'm here to pay you a visit, Melanie. There's no one to stop me. <laughs> cook, cook. Ow, ow. Sonny, what have you done? Sonny. Oh, wait, Melanie's back. <laughs> but I can't let you get away with what you've done. That's it, Sonny. That's it. Didn't I pay for it already? I literally burned a lot. I don't care, Sonny. Your house is going down! No, Melon, I have a family! Not anymore. Die! What is wrong with you? <laughs> Melon, what's that sound? Uh, Quandale, what are you doing here? What have you two knuckleheads done? We built houses for our family? And then Melon exploded mine! What's wrong with you? No, you two don't have families. This was just a simulation I ran as a part of my new experiment. Turns out, you're the worst parents anyone has ever seen in all of Minecraft. Well, my family's still alive. Melon, I literally put a lava bucket on Melanie after I pushed her into the void. But then she revived herself. She got revived because we're in a computer simulation. In real life, she would be burned to a crisp. Oh yeah, good point, Quandale. While you two should never have kids, the viewers should definitely press the subscribe button right now and get us to 600,000 subscribers. Press it right now to get goaded! 